Hi, Sharon Raji Maynard here, mystic and a radical and a Shaw woman. And I'm here to just ask, why would you think about adding a spiritual or energetic healing protocol to your life? Okay, good question. It's a good question for you. Just comment down there. Yes, indeed, in the comments. And if that's something you're interested in, subscribe to this channel. But here is what I'm going to share with you today. Again, the spiral explaining energy. Energy is very fast as it moves from our home in the worlds beyond Earth. It's very fast. Frequency is very high, contains a lot of information. Energy carries information of all kinds. Some of that information is inf information that will be bring benefit, these little blue and some which will cause us to constrict or shut down or even cause death, represented by red. We don't exist just in a physical body. The energy, the life force that keeps that body moving and alive is an energy wave that comes from beyond Earth and that has these frequencies within us. So we are multidimensional beings. And the stories we carry within us, the stories of trauma, the stories of family genetic impacted negativity, the skills we have both within ourselves and uh, from our family, all of those stories are information waves like songs in our energy field. The because Earth is set up as a dense planet, it's a very heavy frequencies, those stories, frequencies begin to show up as our emotions, as our thoughts, and eventually in our life. So if things are showing up in your life, the beginning of those situations, those people, those memories, those behaviors, those responses, have their beginnings in the unseen way beyond the physical. Spiritual, in the way I use it, is not about religion, it's not about church, it's not about righteousness either. It's a frequency, it's a wave of energy that's so fast, so fast, but so unlimited that we can't see or sense it with our tenth physical sensing system, spiritual. Energy is all that we are. If you were going to build a house, you wouldn't just use a hammer and a saw and a screwdriver. It wouldn't be sufficient. And it's the same thing in life. If you want to build a life down here with relationships and community and respect and love and peace, you've got to have the tools that it takes to put that life together. Some of those tools will need to be something that impacts these fast frequencies we call spirit, spiritual tools, spiritual healing. Some of them will have to be emotional tools for emotional healing and emotional input of new seeds. Some will have to be mental tools to impact the mental realm and so on and so on. So in my work, my focus is to help my students, my clients, to gain more tools for their toolbox, along with a greater awareness of who we are in this world we call humanity, but beyond humanity. Now, if that makes sense to you, comment down in the comment box. And again, subscribe to this channel. All that I'm sharing on this channel is not going to be sufficient to really give you a strong toolbox, but it's a beginning place to help you know that there need, you need a toolbox. And then how do you begin to build it, adding the tools that I've created, that I've created from that exploration into the world beyond our physical world. That's when we can work together. So subscribe, explore, 
it's an exciting region of uh, energy and spirituality and how it Im impacts your life today, how it creates a way to make a new life for tomorrow. You're an energy being. Yes. You are multidimensional. Yes. And to make the changes that you want to make, you need an extensive toolbox and greater understanding probably than you've had before. Otherwise, you will be living the life you wanted to live. So subscribe. Come on over to my uh, regular website so that we can see how we could work together. I'd love that. Blessings.